Doreen, in fiction, zombies are the undead who take over your thoughts and body. In real life, though, zombie debt collectors take over old debt, even debt you don't owe, and turn your life into a nightmare. You believe it is in the best interest that you do return to the call as soon as possible. And usually the phone calls are so harassing that the, the consumer feels threatened. Consumer attorney Sonia Smith-Valentine says zombie debt collectors don't check the validity of the debt. They just start making phone calls. They're the debt collectors that go out and buy debt that's 10 years old or debt that's been discharged in bankruptcy or debt that may not even belong to the person who they think they, they're trying to collect from. I've been authorized to process file number 784. Smith Valentine says the zombie's goal is often to get people to pay just to stop the harassment. And it can be a very lucrative goal. Now let's say somebody has a hundred dollar debt. Well, they start harassing that person, and if that person pays that $100, they've made a profit of $99.98. To get you to pay up, zombie debt collectors do things like threaten to sue, threaten to have you arrested, try to get you to accept a bait-and-switch credit card which has the old debt secretly tacked on, or promise to clear an old debt from your credit report for a token payment, which in fact can reactivate that debt. Can they do any of that? No. They often threaten these things because most consumers just don't know that they can't do it. There are no really good numbers. Even the Collection that. Industry I, I Association, the as ACA as International, as well. takes issue with zombie debt collectors. There is no defense for pursuing uh, payment on debts that are, are, not, are not due, and we certainly uh, don't uh, condone that at all. Consumer advocates say if a zombie debt collector stalks you, you should learn about your rights. Know the statute of limitations, usually seven years. Write the collection agency demanding that it stop contacting you and keep an eye on your credit report. They're taking advantage of consumers' ignorance. They know most consumers just don't realize they have rights against debt collectors. One more thought. Attorney Smith Valentine tells us if a zombie debt collector violates your rights, you can sue them. And in most cases, the judge will order the debt collector to pay your attorney's fees. Jim and Doreen, back to you.